hello there welcome back to my channel so today this is the way that i am welcoming you because uh i have no makeup i look like shit but i still want to record my shop my stash so if you're interested in what we are going to be picking for uh, my first rotation of shop my stash in 2022 then just keep on watching Okay, so this is the first shot my stash that I am doing it in this way with my new chest and you know with my new makeup organization so I am so excited about that and I am just wondering how this is gonna all work out uh, but let's just get into it so I have all of my foundations right here and um, I already made kind of a list of things that I want to pull so that this video is not super long but the first thing that I want to pull is this this is my um, L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Fresh Wear Foundation. This is uh, one of the products in my uh, kind of list of things that I want to use up in 2022. So I definitely just uh, want to get that uh, out of my collection uh, in maybe the first quarter of the year. I'm not going to be choosing a primer because I am going to have a primer in my Partners in Cream project pan. So I want to focus on that. But I am going to be choosing a concealer. And the concealer that I want to choose is another L'Oreal product. So this is the L'Oreal Infallible More Than Concealer product. Will this focus? Here we go. I'm not a fan of this concealer. Uh, but I have found a way to make it work. So because this is such a huge tube, I do just want to work through it you know as often as i can just to kind of you know get it out of my collection asap it's very drying on my under eyes so that's why i'm not a fan of it but uh, i can make it work then i have my powders right here so the powder that i want to choose is this one this is the one size powder from um Patrick Stars makeup brand. It is a mini, but I do really enjoy it. And it sets my under eyes very nicely. And also it sets my face uh, very, very well as well. So I am enjoying that. Moving into this second drawer, this is where I have all of my cheek products. So palettes, bronzers, blushes, and highlights. And I want to pull a cream bronzer. So this is the um, Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Contour Wand. Uh, I am really enjoying that. So this is one of the two cream bronzers or cream contours that I have in my collection. So I alternate between them. So it is time for this one this month. Then for cream blush, I'm not going to choose anything because you can see me here. <laughs> here, see, you see that? This and my glasses, not, not a camera ready sort of person. <laughs> anyway, uh, for cream brush, I'm not going to pick a cream blush uh, because if you saw my whole collection project pan introduction, I pulled this ColourPop Lippy Sticks in the shade Parker and it is a beautiful kind of uh, color that I can use on my cheeks as well. So I am going to multi-purpose this for this month. But I am going to choose a cream highlight and the cream highlight that I want to choose is this guy. So this is the Sosu Dripping Gold uh, Glow Stick. This looks like the Charlotte Tilbury uh, Spotlight wand and uh i just love this i've tried it a couple of times and i have been really enjoying the way that it looks on my skin so yeah i just want to test it out for a full month and see how i like it so this is going there i am going to be choosing a bronzer though uh, and uh, the powder bronzer that i'll be choosing this month right or oh no i'm not because i have a powder bronzer in my whole collection project pan which is this one the maybelline city bronzer but i am going to be choosing a powder blush and this is the blush that i want to work on so this is the catrice uh light and shadow contouring uh blush i actually have pan on that already so i just want to work on that and hopefully maybe eventually work it out of my collection this is a really nice kind of basic powder uh blush nothing special to be honest and for a powder highlight i'm not going to be choosing any uh other ones because i am working on my mary luminizer the balm uh 
in my whole collection project pan uh, so yeah i want to i want to have that and then going into this third um uh drawer <laughs> i have some of my i have my lip liners my lippy sticks my eyeliners and my cream shadow so i do want to choose a liquid liner so this i want to choose this one this is the uh, mina uh 575 the color pen eyeliner this is just a brown kind of uh liquid liner i do really enjoy that one and also i want to choose an eyeliner but i don't know what kind of eyeliner do i want because i don't know what i'm going to have in my pan those eyeshadows but maybe i'll choose this one so this is the essence long lasting eye pencil in the shade i have a green which is just a a uh, kind of forest green eye pencil it is a retractable retractable pencil so it looks like this really lovely actually i do really enjoy that one i can use this as a base okay for liquid shadows i'm not going to choose one because uh spoiler i am going to have one in my whole i in my partners in cream my apologies but i do want to choose oh no i don't want to choose a lip liner because i'm working on that as well so I think that is it for this drawer. And for the fifth and final drawer is where I have my declutters, my liquid lipsticks, my uh, normal bullet lipsticks, and then just some lip glosses. Because as I said, I'm working on that lippy stick. I'm not going to choose any lip, uh, uh, like bullet lipsticks. Um, not in the mood for a liquid lipstick this month either but i am going to choose a gloss and the gloss that i want to choose is this one actually can't really see it but this is the anastasia beverly hills uh, gloss and this one is in the shade peachy so it is a beautiful kind of um will it focus please focus nicely hello Hello, maybe I'll just close that and then focus on this. My autofocus, my auto focus is not working properly when I'm using this mode, but this mode gives me the best kind of um, uh, quality. So, you know, maybe I need to change my settings again. But this is what that glass looks like. Just a beautiful kind of very peachy sort of glass. I'm sorry if you hear licking sounds. Mango is in heat, so she's been licking herself. All the time and it's kind of disgusting but there's nothing i can do about that but yeah this is what that looks like really really pretty and it is a mini so maybe hopefully i can work my way out of uh work this one out of my collection quite fast you know but that is it for today's uh video this is my um uh, January makeup basket. I do have uh, some new products, some old products, some products I want to use up, etc, etc. Et but I do like my selection for this month. So if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give this video a like and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much and I will see you in the next one. Bye!